is a man who's gotten Walmart, okay, he has Shopify, which could be a very big deal. But then he picked up Amazon. That's when the stock really went from. It was, the stock had been cratering. Now, what I like about Max, uh, and when you speak to him online or offline, it's not really the same story, which is he, he doesn't like credit cards. He wants to disrupt this industry with technology. He, in particular, wants to go against the cards that charge David interest that is that he finds is usurious. I think a lot of us would feel agree with that. But more importantly, if he succeeds, that if he succeeds, then what do the credit card companies do? Uh, I, I that's a great question. Right? So what what is the answer? Do they have to move into this? I mean. I keep Do they have to lower their interest rates dramatically? Well, that's what he know. wants. He wants to disrupt, and I think that he is so smart and so dedicated. He is a guerrilla force against the Capital Ones of the world. He and I were talking about how, how many credit cards we had when we got out of school and how we were kind of didn't understand. And he wants to tell college kids about business, you know, kids going to business school even. He says people don't even know anything about the idea that you know you're free. This is the, sh uh, uh, the shackles. He wants to take the shackles. Of it's very um, What are the loss ratios like, though, in this business? What, what are the loss ratios like? Well, is it, he's is very it, low. There very low. A, yeah. There was a report from uh, Credit Karma yesterday that a third of U.S. BNPL consumers are behind on at least one payment. Now, but you don't seem too do bothered by I some I directly of this. asked him about Credit Karma because I happen to like that company very much because it's intuit. And many of my friends check their credit rating every day. I don't think it really changes day to day, frankly. But I do know that he said that's just not us. Their loss ratio went down. Uh, their technology, he says, is able to figure things out. We mentioned Ant. You know that the Chinese do this kind of technology. They do. So what? It's the it's the AI. It's the algorithms that can exactly determine right. effectively who is more likely to pay on time than not, and Correct. they won't offer the buy now, pay later to those who. Well, if you miss, their... if you miss, you're done. Okay. Miss, yes, you're they done. Can find... Okay. Well, yeah, but that's not a great customer for them either. Well, but remember, the merchants want the business. The customers like it. Uh, they are less likely to um, feel had. I mean, he, he's about transparency. By the way, PayPal's about transparency, too. So I think when worlds collide, it'll be PayPal versus a firm. Okay. Uh, maybe Square versus a firm. Now, if you're Jamie Dimon, remember, he gave this great speech about, like, hey, what happened? Why aren't we Square? Right. Why aren't we Square? Right. David, why aren't they? Why? Why aren't they square? It's literally well, they, hip to be square. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, he feels like regulation has been one reason, I think. Right. Well, he feels very hamstrung. Yes. Uh, not unlike Charlie Scharf today, although Charlie Scharf only had a $250 million fine yeah. at Wells uh, from the OCC, from the Controller of Currency. Right. A lot of people, the stock fell $20 billion on a $250 million uh, hit, which is why and, you're going to see Wells up today. And meanwhile, B of A, uh, most sweeping management overhaul in more than a decade, new CFO, uh, new general counsel, uh, new tech chiefs. As Moynihan is consolidating some power, it seems. Uh, we in that job a long time already. Yeah. He has. Yeah. But remember, he came up from the ranks uh, he did. as well, a lawyer. He was, he was a lawyer. counsel. Uh, but uh, one of the things, I, when you speak about yeah. what banks are doing the most to advance the social agenda, it's always Brian. The social agenda meaning empowering people. And I think that we don't expect any of the banks that are listed there to be forces of good, so to speak. That's just not true. But the fact is, David... When they lend, they charge, okay? Right. They have been, um, they're the man versus firm, square, PayPal. They're the man. Remember the man? Uh, yes. The man? Stick it to the man. Yes. Yes. And that's what Max Lepsch well, is about. The market Sticking kind it of to is. the man. I mean. Shepard Smith here. Thanks for watching CNBC on YouTube.